Hey, Bryce, I wanted to congratulate you with the reviews that you have on this listing. I know how competitive the category can be, so to see the ratings that you have is really a job well done. Now, my job is to look for potential opportunities with sellers who prioritize on Amazon. And if it's okay with you, I'd like to show you a few opportunities I found with your listing. These are things that will help grow sales. My name is Sean, and I'm an account manager with my Amazon guy. So listen, I'm going to pack this full of valuable information for you. Let's dive right in. Now, the first thing I want to show you is your keywords. So let's talk about those. They're pretty low right now. I see you've got 133 sponsored and 1,071 organic keywords. Now, we do a lot in the beauty category, and we recommend a one to two ratio. So for every one sponsored, you have two organic keywords. Um, but let's see how your keywords are performing. Now, I sorted by the most frequently used, frequently clicked on. <clears throat> and look at this, brow lamination kit. Your ranking is very good. Now, I will tell you, I have been working on my brows forever. I'm 49. I've over tweezed. I did not know that it was called a brow lamination kit. <laughs> so I've always been interested and I wanted to try it at home before I tried it. So um, I'm curious how many other women feel the same way as me. Um, but lovely that you have this rank really good. 21,000 people clearly know <laughs> what that means. Um, you've got it with eyebrow lamination kit too as well. See, I would have thought eyebrow tinting kit, henna brow tint, eyelash tint, you know, those kind of things. But let's take a peek over here. So I want to show you something. Look at your organic rank. Um, I would say more... Uh, probably 50% of your 50 most frequently used keywords right now, you're in the triple digits, which means that your pages, 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 pages deep, sometimes dozens or more. And that's really hard. Anytime you're over 50 in the organic listing, like this right here, henna brown tent, eyelash tent, that's really high. It's going to be hard to find you. So let's take it a step further. Here we go. So we've got Lash Kit right here. 9,600 people are looking for Lash Kit. You're organically ranked number 99. So that means you've got all of these sponsored ads that are showing up before yours and the 98 other organic ads that are showing up before yours for the words Lash Kit. And just to give you an idea how much revenue is going to be generated by these two words on Amazon this month alone, let's, let's see here over $2 million. That's over $25 million a year. That's incredible. And you're ranked 99. So it is going to be really hard for you to get any of your share of this revenue. And that's just one example. I saw several where your keywords definitely need updating both organics and sponsored. Now, I found this listing by taking these words directly from your title, Eyelash Perm. Found this listing here. Now, I'm not doing any product comparisons. What I want to show you is this. Look at this. Look at their organics, right? They've got 2,645 organics, 692 sponsored keywords. They have been online, I think, maybe six months different than you. They are selling more. That's for sure. They show up in over 3,600 different variations of searches, you only show up 1,300. So they've got three times the reach that you do, which means they're reaching three times the customers. Um, so scrolling down, or actually, let me show you something that we do within phase three of our three-phased SEO process. So we look at those organic keywords where you're ranked in spots 20 through 50, and right now you've got 224 of them. And because of that, you're really not benefiting. Like I said, anytime you're less than 50, you're really not going to feel that traffic. So what we would do is work to improve and optimize your listing so that for Lash Lift, instead of being 38, we'd have you in the top 10, right? So, and that's 224 keywords. Imagine the traffic that you would receive there. And if you're not having to sponsor those words, it can help with your ACOS too as well. So food for thought on that. Now back over here, let's talk about the fun stuff. I'm going to get out of the way here. Let's look at your images. So I love that you show all of the, the contents of your package. And if this is the packaging, really well done. I understand why you put this here. 
you know what I don't see? There's no like before after or someone who did it on one eyebrow and not the other, right? You absolutely need to see that in these images here. The images are what creates the click, right? So you want to make sure that you're testing your images. We do A-B testing on all of them to make sure that we've got the right image that's going to garner the most clicks. And I think you can make some improvements here, um, certainly with like before and after. Um, and then your title looks like your title's a little short. You can go up to 200 characters. Yeah, you've only got 139. You could put 60 more characters here. Imagine the, the words that you can integrate um, that aren't being used that we saw over in Helium 10. Now, scrolling down here, I understand your first bullet and why you have it like that. I do recommend increasing the content in some of these others. You can have 250 characters within each bullet. And this is in your title and here are one of the two spots that Amazon looks to for your organic keywords. I do recommend being brand registered. I'm surprised to see you're not because you've got a wonderful brand. Um, brand registry also gives you so many more features and benefits on Amazon that you don't have access to now, including uh, your A plus content down here being part of it with your brand story and your brand store. So you're missing out on a lot of real estate um, and looking down here at your alt text, I would definitely update your alt text. So if I were looking for a product like this, I don't know Scalpa, although I do believe you should leave that there. I'm not going to type in the word logo. I'm going to type in brow lift, eyebrow lift, eyelash lift, eyelash perm, eyebrow perm, something along those lines, the frequently used keywords that we saw. Um, scrolling down. And then we also recommend 500 to 1,000 words of copy in between your images. So 500 to 1,000 because it does index for organic keywords. These are the images you need up top. This is what I was talking about. I do recommend at least one, if not both. These two images here are fantastic, or at least this one and this one. Um, very good. I would include those. Also, if you've got this, those other products, you should have a product grid down below that helps increase your average order value. You've got a lot of great images here. I do think you should um, integrate some of these into your header. Uh, but listen, here at my Amazon guy, we're a 225 person agency. We grow sales on Amazon. Now we manage over 200 brands, giving our clients peace of mind, knowing that Amazon is handled so that they can focus on their business. But yeah, I'd love that opportunity to chat with you. So click the link in my email that reads book a call, snag yourself a free consultation. And then once you do that, I'll email out that competitor analysis. But thanks so much for watching. I look forward to speaking with you soon. Take care.